Tell you what your muffins, Peppy. Hot, cool. Body temperature. What the hell? Who is this nutter? Uh, she can't be a nutter. She's so sweet. Look at the bunny. She is kind of cute in a sexy stalker psycho kind of a way. <clears throat> you know, I've uh, always admired a woman with pets. It shows their nurturing side. They call me Pony. His name's Peppy. Before Peppy, there was Princess Di. And then there was River Phoenix. And, and Kurt Cobain. They're all dead. Oh, not to me. They've all got a special place in my heart. Like you, Peppy. Look, Merlene, whatever your game, you can't just barge in here and take over our house. You've never felt it, have you? What? That inexplicable moment when you see someone and you just know. Look, oh, I don't think we're talking about me. Or if you have felt it, you push it away because you've been so afraid to lose it that you decide not to take it at all. You think that's independence? I'll stop this. The, the, the muffins. I'm trying to keep no, my patience with this woman. I mean, because I used to leave our house and now. Is that the reason you would kidnap a bunny? Oh, you didn't kidnap it. It was kidnapping. I was just, I was just making muffins for my boyfriend and he grabbed the bunny. Boyfriend? Oh, now can, that's ridiculous. Can you please not yell. Peppy's shaking. He's going to need to see a specialist twice this week. Okay, this is crazy. This woman, she just broke into our house, set up camp and will not go. So are you going to do your job or not? You two can go. <laughs> not you two. You and the bunny. What? What part of I'm in charge here don't you understand? You should get that little guy home. See that? Did you just see that? There's some kind of bunny preference going on here. Seriously, like, why did this? You're the ones who've been white. I need to talk to your superior. So we're going to do this the hard way. 